So it's um, Thursday, August 30th. Um, already a stressful morning and it's only 6.30 a.m. So I came outside with my little ladies because they always de-stress me. And I will show you this week's Bible verse on my arm. So here is my verse. It's Ephesians 3.20 20 through 21. I um, love this one too. Um, live expectantly, which is what we all should be doing. And then... I'm out with my little ladies because chickens make everything better. So do you ever find yourself kind of like um, in the fork in the road? Um, you're middle-aged, you're really tired of drama and things around you and you just thank God for his holy grace. Um, the advantage to being able to homeschool and deal with issues that you have going on in real life um, it just it can sometimes you just have to push past it and just sometimes change your direction a little bit um, on where you stand with life and people and um, make the best choices that is what is best for you and your family <clears throat> of course we'll always homeschool because that's what we do um, but there's a lot of other things we need to adjust and decisions we need to make um, just because life happens and sometimes you don't need that additional stress in your life and when you can avoid it then you eliminate it and I found between that and lots of prayer and God's wisdom that um, we make the right choices and things will work out the way they should be So real life happens um, Homeschool mom crazy crazy first week of school um, a lot of personal stuff going on um, It's just a lot of stuff has interfered with um, the normal routine we would have with homeschool so We've had to adjust that this week um, hoping next week we'll start fresh in a normal routine, but the bonus about homeschooling is you can work around your life um, and the kids still get their schooling in so um, and I'm out here with my little ladies um, because they wanted to get out early in the morning I'll show you them hey ladies hey ladies it's nice and cool here in Minnesota so they're starting to like it not being so hot until it gets really cold, then they probably won't like that either. So even with this insanely crazy week, we managed to take the girls also to their very first ice cream parlor, not just your normal place that serves ice cream, an actual ice cream shop. So that was fun. I have pictures attached of that, and I also have pictures of all the kiddos, but my youngest, because she did not want her picture taken. Um, attached to for the first day of school so you'll see those next Thanks for watching my video. If you liked this video, please click the like button and subscribe to my channel to receive weekly notifications on when new videos are put out.